Hey guys, comment of the day goes to this man right here. If you guys would like to win comment of the day, make sure you comment down below. Remember, I am replying to every single person that comments. Enjoy the Hey guys, I'm Monkey Moon back here for another video, guys. Welcome back to the episode of my daily sniping series. And to start this off right away, you see right here, I actually ended up getting that card for about 14,000 coins. And I'm going to go ahead and put him back up for about 24,000 because that was about a 10k snipe. Which really is not that bad. Now if you go ahead and see right here. This card does end up selling. Not in this video. But end up selling later on. For about 23,000 coins. I had to put him back off for 23,000. But he ended up selling. So about a 9-10k snipe. Not that bad. Now I've been getting a lot of questions in the comment section. About what do I think. Will the most viewer promo be a cash grab. Or will it be you know more or less you can actually grind and get these cards and have fun without spending money now obviously this year a lot of people have called it the year of the nat you know the cash grab year all about that money year all that kind of nicknames ea have been giving you know month this year will this first true holiday promo as you guys if you guys do not know the promos we've been having i call them I don't I don't know exactly what the you know the def what um what's it called what EA calls them, but I call them um side promos because there's like we have holiday promos we have the um Halloween we have the um Thanksgiving Christmas you know Super Bowl well not really Super Bowl but you know those holidays so whatever holiday is going on in real life we have that holiday promo in Madden now the side promos is usually where EA does the cash grab stuff where it's like if you want to go ahead and do this promo you have to spend money and that's something that I feel like you know a lot of people kind of misunderstanding when it comes to this game that we've had those for years we've always had cash grab promos that again I call side promos because they're not the holiday promos that are the main promos not every single month but we have a you know holiday promo for october november december um we have easter promo fourth of july promo you know whatever holiday promo those are the promos that i feel like really aren't all about money and more or less about a huge update to the game when it comes to content so to answer the question will this next promo be a cash grab I want to say no. I don't think it will be a cash grab because I feel like this next promo we're about to have is is going to be about, you know, again, a holiday promo. It's going to be about introducing content to the game more than trying to get your money and trying to get your wallet. Will there be ways for you, you know, to spend money and to get your money? Yes, of course. Every single promo possible or anything possible in this game, will there will be a way to get your money. But I think that this next holiday promo will in some way revolve around, you know, more or less than just a cash grab. So that's, in my opinion, going to be really awesome and very excited about that. One thing that really annoys me, and I just want to cover this right now because I just showed you guys, is yes, when you buy cards, no longer does the, um, the whole thing reset. But now, when you leave the auction block, the second you leave it, it automatically resets. It didn't. It never used to do that. Cause I used to always go ahead and check on if an auction sold, and I go right back in the auction block and start sniping again. But now it resets completely when you leave the auction block screen. Kind of annoying because if you you know just disconnect from the server or you know you get kicked out of other uh, um ultimate team for whatever reason you go back in you have to set up all your filters again so with that in mind um also in this video i'm actually trying to get 84 overall um trying to get in a sniper on 84 overall players so that's why i have these filters and as you're at the beginning of the video it is very very rewarding if you can this is actually a method that i've been trying recently and it's been working a lot again you go ahead and just snipe you know 84 overall players a lot of them will sell for like 20 to 22k and because most of them you know actually go for 14k people just throw these up for 14,000 coins and go ahead and get a quick snipe and actually resell it now the snipe you saw at the beginning of the video this is actually at 1 a.m when that snipe took place which surprisingly at 1 a.m usually you never get those type of snipes but nonetheless you know you always it depends on what filters you use these are another another good filters i recommend using 
uh, to get some good snipes. But nonetheless, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Tell me down below what you guys think. Do you think that this next promo will be a cash grab? Or do you think it will be, you know, actually have some really good content in it and you can get it without, you know, spending money? That's just my personal opinion. I do not think it will be a cash grab, but, you know, a lot of times we have seen so many cash grabs in this game. I understand why some people might feel differently. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.